Ladies and gentlemen, isn't it? Greetings, breakfast all over the world. My name is Izinne, and I want to dedicate this song to my able director, Mazin Amdekano, for his love, his kindness, and his faithfulness to his with the beer friends. I see Michuko Kabiyama continue to bless, protect him, and guide him from the eyes of our foes. I also want to appreciate my family, the great family writers. They have been wonderful through their articles. I see the Chukwu Kabiyama continue to give them more intellect to write me. Thank you all. When he spoke, the world trembles. Pops who said, it's truth from thee. Heels and chants to set me free. Heels and pants to dry my tears. We get from that red food. Pops is right up short on us. I tend to pull through Kabiyama to send in the sun. Number Kano, oh, number Kano, you are the one. Number Kano, you are the one. You are the one. Hey, number Kano, oh, number Kano, you are the one. Number Kano, you are the one. It got me. I'm the 
Yes, good morning, fellow Biafras. Lovers of freedom, men and women of goodwill, conscious of people wherever you are, I will say good morning, good afternoon, good evening, and to some of you, good night, depending on your time zone. This is Radio Biafra Extra for the Avoidance of Doubt, a live broadcast. We are streaming live through Radio Biafra London, being anchored by the Deputy Leader of the indigenous people of Biafra, Mazi Uchi Uka from Efo. He is from Abatete. Abatete is in Anambra. In Anambra State is Biafra land. He's the one who have assured us that he will not allow the heart of this project to see corruption. He stand in a deputizing capacity on behalf of our Supreme Leader Mazen Nandioku Kano, the Prince of Afari Beku, the only man who took it upon his shoulder to carry everybody along, to speak for everybody. No wonder the Bible says there is no greater love than this that a man should lay down his life for his fellow. Go and look at more than 90% critics of our Supreme Leader Martin Nandekano. That are abnormal. These are people he's dying for. <laughs> but then, only the genuine ones know what he stands for. And all the genuine Biafras across the globe. We are with him. He remains our Supreme Leader. He commands the loyalty of the Biafran people. And we are here for one thing, our freedom. He's the director of Radio Biafra and Biafra Television. And I see me, the name of Elohim be praised, who have sent us a leader in a time like this, who refused to collect money. And of course, I am George Unibe. I am from Abo. Abo is in Delta State, and Delta State is Biafra land. Without wasting much of our time, we must appreciate the Almighty Creator, Chuku Kika Biyama, the one that sits in heaven and presides over the affair of man. Anye na jaya mahu, makanez yoku no maramaye, ehuna ya ya na inagia, ubi omaya, ujura nyanya dadio, ema kwa ningwe gimbangu, Oh, the uni, the kage, ebo wa fanu mega. Anye nene na sena, ede mao. We'll be going to our topic this morning, which is simple, titled, The Desperation of Nigeria. The Desperation of Nigeria. Nigeria is a very bastardly, dastardly, desperate country. It, of course, it's a company. Very desperate one. Let's see, how can we break it down? When a woman falls in love with you desperately, if you can't manage her, you are in trouble. A criminal has something they feel they must rob you, remove it from you. And they are desperate to rob you if you know once they ask for that and give it to them. That is why you see, just because of 30 naira phone, somebody will shoot you. Most of you have lost your relatives. Because these criminals are so desperate that we must snatch every phone. Anybody may pen, they are gone. And at that moment, they lost the mind to reason. That moment, they are no longer human. 
Burana Nema. When you see British government so desperate to subdue Africa, all these so-called powers so desperate to subdue Africa and keep them in abject poverty, this desperation has removed the part of human, homo sapien, that is, that is in them. Because only animals live by the instinct to kill others in order to survive. They live by the, this instinct out of desperation. No, it doesn't matter. We, 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 we will kill them. We will oppress them. Desperation to steal all you. You see our water in every nook and cranny of Biafra land with AK-47. You think we are fighting war already. It is out of desperation. But let me tell them, that war will come. Because Nigerian will, at the end, initiate this general state of anarchy. This is what we are waiting for. No Sharia law will stop it. No AK-47 will stop it. No world power will stop it. And this is what will happen. Nigeria is uploading already. And both the hours, Safu, Lani, Yoruba, Biafra, Delta, Niger, Upland, River, and all of us will run out of this land. And to come here, to come here. You see, when people, you, you have not seen tomorrow, and you refer me to yesterday, that is why you remember where you are. All those Zonophobia and Vibia African country, get ready because about 70 years ago they told you the population of Nigeria is 180 million, but they lie because take 50 years plus today, what 180 million would have given birth to? Nigerians are over 10 million, they are over 10 million, but that is not what you are looking at. What we are telling you is that. Without war, ordinary hunger, many wish to die in the Mediterranean Sea. Do you know what they go through? Just to come to your land for greener pasture. When you are the one poisoning the green pasture in our land, imagine when it starts. No war will stop immigrants from pulling down those wars. Just get ready. Because we see that it's only when it starts the God nations will come and play God. Okay, it's okay, it's okay, it's okay. It takes a few good men to restore a nation. Are you not tired of building country? Are you not tired of building country? I mean, company and call it country. Nations must be restored. Out of desperation, you have no idea what Nigerians are capable of doing and what their intentions are and what they are going to do. Have you ever wondered why they are so desperate in subduing Biafran people? You just, just look everywhere. Any small thing, they want to sub, subdue Biafran, they want to intimidate Biafran, they want to harass Biafran, they spend billions to subdue you out of desperation. Out of desperation. Or maybe you haven't noticed it. You've not noticed it. Mm, you will notice it very soon, don't worry. Yoruba and our Wasafulani, so desperate and sabotage to us with the British government to make sure. They, go and look at British government issue statement about Nigeria. You begin to think if they actually came from Nigeria. You think the British government came from Nigeria? No, you know, we are the God of Africa, we are Britain, the British government, we the Europeans and the Europeans has made it clear that the territorial integrity and the territory integrity of Nigeria can never be allowed to, you begin to think, is this territory, territorial integrity, is it actually worth more than our life? But when it was time to use Bakasi Peninsula to settle France, because they own the company called Cameroon. The, this very, very almighty, wonderful territorial integrity, British government will set the whole world ablaze to protect was given out to Cameroon. You begin to wonder, these are our despised, very horrific acts against the people out of desperation. But what are they desperate about? They want to steal oil? Are they not seeing that oil is running out of relevance? But we must continue. Or you choose to ignore this art of desperately wickedness, hoping it will stop one day. 
<laughs> Some people are sorry, are saying, don't worry, Nigeria is still uh, 50 years old, you know. Uh, before we get to like America, you know, America is like, I think 200 and something years old, if I'm not mistaken. You see, before we get as old as America, and then uh, it is going to be all right. But go back and check America at 60 years. You will see that Africa in totality is not anything close to America in one year because they were men and women of dream who choose not to overlook any stupid act of hopeless, desperate British government. They paid the price. The Indians paid the price, among others. But you, you are a black man. You believe in that somewhere is going to come from the sky and he's going to say, oh, ye British government, go out of Nigeria. Why will he do that? Because you believe that your Holy Ghost fire you have been praying in Yoruba church is going to send them away. It will never send them away. You see, when we get to like 100 years, your founding fathers, all of them are dead. You remember those who killed your founding father. They are the one in charge. They, all of them are old and worn out. <laughs> look at Bukhari. He's dead, replaced by another lunatic. Go and look at Oba Sanjo. He wants to show you he, he, he's agile. Why is he aging? This morning, I watched the video of uh, Jack Gowan, the very murderous general of the African continent army when he was in Uganda, with the army Gada. Maybe they were planning on how to destroy Africa completely. He was overthrown. I was, he was doing like a sharp man. Gowan, come now, come and do politics. So they are wasa fulani. In fact, the fulani will tell you how hopeless you are. You are general. And nobody will copy after again. Is a copy after you charge for treason felony. Go on, you are the one. You are the one. Hey, come now. Hey, he can't be after he'll be charged for treason felony. Look at what fulanis are doing to you. You people are the original owner of Plateau State. You allow foreigners, foreigners, Mohammedan zombies to take over your land. Out of desperate, as I speak to you, Yoruba collaborating with you people because they want all you. I will come for you, Niger Delta and Delta Niger and Biafra. You're not seeing this desperation. No, don't worry. We are praying already. I'm a prayer warrior in my church. In my church, I'm a prayer warrior. Don't worry. We're going to pray. Everything is going to spoil. We will pray. There are mad people. You are not seeing Nigerian desperation. Nigeria is so desperate that even Yata Aisha said the truth that Buhari is dead. She will be killed. So desperate that if you stand between British government and this company, call one Nigeria, even after the expiration of amalgamation, so-called fraudulent amalgamation of Nigeria, you will be hunted down like an animal. It's just that IPOB have become Ibu Nyabo. Ibu Nyabo. And you too have to be one. No, you can ignore it. Now, think again. We have been surrounded in our own land. That we are in complete lockdown situation. We have been surrendered. For the past four, year, four days now, they are killing in Atali. Atali is beside the Limbu. This is around Rumukurushi. This is Obi Apoluka government. There have been killing ongoing. What do you think is happening? Police key, civilian key, court is key. But out of desperation, the Fulanis, the Boko Haram, they are there in your land already. Very soon you will know. And then I say, oh, IPOB airport, oh, IPOB airport. We are going on holiday. Our holiday is coming. Oh. August break is coming. Oh. Because when this killing becomes rampart, you, we, we will offer you Biafra so you will enjoy it very well. Because you're going to look for who to talk to you. You're not going to see any of them. A leader will be coming to Germany on the 27th. He's going to meet with Biafra people in the Munich. If you are in the Munich, in Germany, you are in Germany, North Germany, West Germany, South Germany, Bottom Land Germany, Up Germany, River Rhine Germany, on top of Land Germany, if you are in Germany, all road lead to the Munich on the 27th of this month. On Saturday, Ask your question because out of the simulation of the zoo called Nigeria and the British government, our children are going to see something. Then go teach something. You know, go understand. If I speak grammar, you know, go get to your blood. Our children go teach something if we don't do what we're supposed to do now. 
you have the time to do what you ought to do. And then you can claim big boy. Like I said, I'm planning to relocate to America. And I'm going to live very close to uh, uh, Donald Trump. Or maybe uh, Bush, George Bush. Not because I love comfort in America. I love this English, man. Because there are two languages you can use to insult people very well. You get to the abo marrow. That is France. You just speak French. Brrr, you insult everybody. It looks like a song. Put beat into it. You are okay. You become the best uh, musician in the world. Then use American English. Nigga, man. Nigga, man. You get no crazy, man. Just put it. It becomes a music. That is why I want to go there. So your children will buy this track. No, you know, so no, 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 no. We, we're going to be safe. Like, let's comport ourselves. Let's behave like a normal human being. We have been behaving not like normal human being all the days of our life. What has he yielded us to? A gentleman. A gentleman with chain on their neck. Are you, are you not seeing? Are you not seeing the chain on your neck? <laughs> Our freedom have been taken. Our land is under lockdown. A prince was killed in Obibu. And nobody is going to talk about it. So radio station will say, uh, uh, Akwaibon and Awosa are fighting in River State. So Akwaibon now is not fighting Awosa. The other one will say, no, Igbo joined Akwaibon to kill a full any terrorist. Hey. Then the next radio, radio station say, no, it is Igbo fighting uh, uh, Awosa. It's not a Bible. But anything you like, Biafrans must understand that out of desperation, Nigeria will stop at nothing. You people don't see what is coming. Along the line, they say, oh, IPOB have divided. They will now have iPod and tripod. He started making ways. Oh, hey, they are divided. You see, that's why I don't want to join IPOB. Look at, but we didn't divide. Out of desperation, they divided us. We know what is called the strategy of born identity. We know. Where is Teleport? Where is iPod? Where is Oku, the lead generated IPOB leader? According to Nigerian government. Out of desperation. There is nothing that they will not do. Very soon you hear 20 pod, 40 pod. The one that is raining now is a frog, toad, who claimed to be by a salmon. But he's running away from his own village, his own fatherland. He's a river state man. Come back to Karabari. I take care he's waiting for you. I only pity those who allow these jihadists to remain in their land. And somebody is going to say, don't talk to him, leave him. We will talk all, to all of you. When we are done with you, you think Buhari died for nothing? When we expose Buhari and see how hopeless he is, Gawan is alive because he's going to see some horrific experience before he die. I thought he's Jack Gawan. Jack. Do you know when they call you Jack in the Western world, man, it's going to mean that you are a tough man. Why is he in the assemblies of God praying to God, man? I thought Jack Gowan was a tough man, man. He cannot show us toughness, man. Because the tough guys are not yet born, man. They are uh, mad people. No, 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 no. You, you have to take it easy. Be a gentleman. But of course, I'm a gentleman. I'm a gentleman. I was properly indoctrinated. I know what it means to be a gentleman, conduct or uh, exhibit it. If I form for you, I go ginger your song, they tell you the truth. If I form for you, give you Queen's English, you go, they wonder whether or not George Onibe, they talk to you. But all the Queen's English where you don't speak, all the ginger where you don't ginger, all the Mara where you don't Mara, where you take us go? Nigerian out of desperation will step you down and reduce you to an animal. Look at justice on there. The one that went to Nigerian Bar Association, attended university, and a honorable LLB have been reduced to monkey and baboo. In fact, banana leaf. And a Sharia law who learned how to lead lie, lie, heal, lie, Bakaram is he lie, lie. It's not your chief justice. The way he says, I started showing you video. I built mosque in my father's land. Ah, I built mosque. You think Asari is telling you he built mosque? He is calling attention of jihadist Islamic nation across the world. He is trying to tell them that come and sponsor me. I will help you stop IPOB. But oh, Bieri. Oh, Bieri, oh, Nikure. Let me speak Yoruba for you because you are Yoruba man. We are uncovering your identity. We will know the Odukoya, Olukoya, Olowo, Adododo, the other that gave birth to. Asali is a Yoruba man. Every true Indian man must disassociate with him. These are work of desperation. 
our freedom have been taken from us. That is the reason we fight for freedom. But you don't know. You don't know your freedom is taken from you. Forget about your position you occupy now as a Biafran across the globe. Just come to the Yoruba and our Wosa that rule you and say, I'm beginning to show interest in this Biafran issue. The next thing they will ask you is, say, what do you mean? You say, I think a Biafran should be allowed to go. EFCC, ICPC, DSPP, PPQ, Boko Haram, Fulani, Hesme, Miatiala, all of them are going to call your number. They will call your number. You will be in almighty shit. You're going to see trouble, man. Your pastor is going to deny you, man. You're going to see how miserable you are, man. And you're going to know why we come to Radio Biafra and shout and shout and shout, man. It's not because we cannot use firewood and pursue these people out of our land, man. We just want them to finish and exhibiting the level of their stupidity, man. Why they are exhibiting their stupidity and thinking that they are deceiving and killing and conquering Biafra, man. You're going to wake up. If you fail to wake up, man, you're going to see what you are looking for. You're going to see what you are looking for. Those of you in Germany, West Germany, North Germany, Boston Germany, Up Germany, East Germany, Frankfurt, you, you know, I, I, I have issue pronouncing words. But go to the Munich. Find out where our Supreme Leader Martin Nandi Kano is coming from. You are from Egala, you are from Edoma, you are from Eyala, you are from Aruchikum, Bito, Rumba, Nombi, Se, Amando, Bankuri, Abo, Owere, Otoloko, Akumazi, Owere, Irobo, Shekiri, Kalabare, Wakrike, wherever you come from, Ikwere, Okwere, Ikwere, Onigu, come there. Because this rain, this cloud that is gathering, it is going to fall. Nigerian out of desperation are very ready to extinct us. But out of the same desperation, we will respond adequately. But we must continue. And freedom has been taken. That should be the reason. We must begin to think of tomorrow. Today, as we speak, out of desperation, to keep looting the resources in Biafra land, and Yoruba, and the British government has taken over our life. When you see Yoruba, out of desperation, Yoruba know evil. They see evil. They do evil. But they see, okay, what is there? Hey, let, 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 let's join our Saful and British government. At least, uh, at all, at all, nine bad pass. If you they use at all, at all, nine bad pass, you are hopeless, you are lunatic, and you are in trouble. You are in trouble. You need to take more tramador because of Radio Biafra now. Nigerians are willing to give you the true identity of criminals across the globe who call themselves Nigerian. Before you would have heard this Igbo man who carried drugs, Igbo man who steal Igbo man, baby fat Igbo man, kidnapper Igbo man. We are waiting for you. Bring the name of criminals across the globe. Let's see if they are Biafrans who will expose you, who will shred you. Is it Biruke or Adebuli? She has not recovered from the attack. Now they are telling you that there are many people working in Lagos International Airport. They are the ones smuggling drugs into people's back. Let me tell you, if you are listening to me as a world power, as a governing and a sovereign state that have been delivered from terrorism, when I mean terrorism, political terrorism, where you catch somebody with drug, please find out. Because what Yoruba and Awosa does in international airport, the moment you bear Biafra name, they will plant drug inside your inside your distance. And they will tell you, in the bone, a good drug. We don't do drugs. We have what it takes to survive. This is what they've been doing to us. That is why I say, when you see anybody say, I'm a Biafra, I am a Biafra, consider their matter. Now, look at them now. At the end of the day, to repair, to manage their image, they say, we now discover that uh, Yusuf Buhari and uh, Aminu uh, 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 Gowan, all of them are uh, working in airport. We suspect they are the one planting drugs inside people traveling back because there was one Alahaja that uh, traveled with one bag. He ended up having two bags and they arrested her. They are trying to manage the image. Nigerian leaders are drug addicts. Plenty cocaine in Nigeria. Plenty Igbo, Igbo, plenty one. This is what they sell. Oil is not enough for them. These people are gluten. Very greedy people. They set Biafrans up. Come and set us up. We are waiting for you. It's unfortunate. Asare joined them. 
Oh, oh, okay, uh, yeah, I show you. I will review you. Don't bring this back to her. Uh, you don't know what is going on. Okay, make it from Nanya. Imaron and the Kano boy king war here. So when Nigeria is telling you, we are going to give you Python dance. I'm not quite king war here, dear mama. Ndiera. To be able to go in Swasso, so you know what you agree with, okay. They could not mind me. They could not mind me. If I if I have my way, we're going to say this, we're going to say this, we're going to say it over and over and over till our people will understand what we mean. It is time to consider your ways. Oh, you a giddy man. Consider your way. Niger Delta man, Delta Niger man, upland, river and bottom land. You see, I am an Igbo man. But Nigeria and British government say I am not an Igbo man. So now, I am a Niger Delta man. I am a Niger Delta man. Now, let's analyze it. Whatever that is left of us is in the custody of Igbo people. All the oil in Ijo land belong to Jigawa. And Asari is being paid 10 million every year. 10 million US dollar. Ego Igwe. Asari and all the hopeless, useless people fighting for one Nigeria from his own land are benefiting from it. Asari is receiving 600 million naira every month. He turned you to Muslim. The willing tools like they did to the middle bed. But soon you will regret like the middle bed. I thought God one is a middle bed. He's a willing tools. Let him come and choose his father now. I respect Igbo man. Igbo be France. Ijo be France. I respect all of you. But let me tell you what you don't know. You go to Akwa Ibom. That is where you see a Nam and Ibibio. They are there together with the Eka. You go to Cross River State. They don't even know where they come from. Because our side is not selling. Our side are indigenous of Cross River State. But we know them. You come to Bayasa. There is problem. Because half of Bayasa children now are product of Yoruba terrorism. You go to Benue. We have Igbo in Benue. We have Benue Idoma. There is confusion. You go to... The gala. You have a gala in everywhere. In fact, after Gunelli and Munelli, the rest community is a gala. Now, what am I trying to say in effect? Open your eyes, shine your eye. And now check who will save us, who will go for us. But there is one tribe that is still together. This is the Igbo Biafra. With Tamazen and the Kano, the Igbo Biafra were being torn apart bit by bit. David Umaru, I will summon the governor of Ebony State. Now he's telling, hey, our Ebony is not a, our Ebony is not a, the Biafra. I'm on the, I was, I see you, I was, I know, I man, I am an Asuswani, I change the song, we are along the line. And now, so see, David Umaru, the governor of Ebony would have told you that you are from Awosa. Because most of you, you think you are mocking Ebony man. Where you can't say, the wah, 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 wah. If you see any Igbo man calling Ebony man, wah, 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 to mock that, know they are Yoruba, Awosa blood, full any blood. They are terrorists. Go and find out who he says the wah, wah, wah. He says, wah, 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 is the father to the first lawyer of black monkey, baboon, chimpanzee of Biafra land. But the boy, people are void of reasoning. So when they call you in the wah wah wah, you say, "Hey, if you na wah na pali ani na pali in the wah wah wah, man andi awo sa wah ne yani soko. Iga waje surindi awo sa kena ara soko. Iga ra ano ah 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 ah. How do they call breast? Iga ra ano ah 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 ah. Very soon, you gonna lick cow breast very soon, so your head can properly position as cow. Efi, efi ibu. Ne make efi awo sa. The highest way to insult a monkey and babu from Biafra, once they call you, you are Aosa goat, know your own is finished. Because Igbo said, Igbo goat have sense. What am I trying to say in effect? What I'm trying to say in effect is simple. Without the Igbo, Biafra is gone. We are gone. There are oil everywhere in Igbo land for your information. And they are still on ground there. But when they finish dealing with you as Niger Delta and Delta Niger upland river and bottom land pro, 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 when they finish dealing with you, they're coming for us. But if they are not harassing you today, it is because they feel you know the Bible says before you invade a strong man house, you first of all tie the strong man. The strong man of the Afro nation is the Igbo man. They want to cripple the Igbo man, then they can come and vandalize everywhere. So when you are yapping, go and reason. Consider the desperation of 
This zoo called Nigeria and British government company. Ndara. Mad people. Well, it's only one day that one man. For you to become a governor, a politician, a senator, a toro toro, assembly maker, whatever you are as a Biafran, you can't hide. When my father was going to school, there was something like, what do they call it? Bite of Biafra and Bite of Bene. There is still Bite of Bene. Who removed Bite of Biafra? You have people like Asari receiving, what, what, how much is he receiving? 10 million US dollars annually. Why would he tell you that Bite of Biafra was formerly in heaven? Some of you think Egypt is in heaven. Israel is in heaven. Because the Bible make it look as if they are in heaven. They are not in heaven, no. Dear mama, most of you don't know that Moses was born in Africa, raised in Africa, buried in Africa, have a girlfriend in Africa, died in Africa, lived in Africa, he got to resurrect in Africa. You believe what you don't know? Oh my God. You don't have a governor because all your politicians, they go to see Satan of Sokoto. When they go to see Satan, Satan, I didn't say Sultan, Satan of Sokoto, they endorse them. Where is, uh, is, it, is it there to uh, Odechi? That Peter Odechi son. You well, Odechi. Unyara. Where are you? Where is uh, Okenkwo? All of a sudden, we don't see you on social media again. Come and tell us how hopeless Igbo people are. But one day, you will wish you were an Igbo man. You see, there is a song I love. When I want to cry, I play that song. And that song say, Take a message to Mary, but them tell her I'm in jail. Take a message to Mary, but don't tell her what I'm going through. You can tell her that you see me drinking tombo. You can tell her that you see me smoking ibu. You can tell her that life is okay for me, but you must go and tell him that I am somewhere in prison. Because she's going to die if you tell her I'm in prison. So I beg you, take this message and tell her to marry another man if she cannot wait for me. He won't you are a very hopeless woman. Be. Go and listen to that song. Maybe you will cry like me, like I cried early morning. You think it's a sign of weakness? It's a sign to make you see if you are still human being or your animal. Because animals live by the instinct. You kill others in order to survive. But homo sapiens lay down their life for another. You don't have any politician. If Satan of Sokoto does not endorse them, they are not there for you. They decide the law that they enforce. Go and pass a bill that we make Nigerians supposed to be greater. They say, no, no, no. The law we want to pass is Sharia law. La la hila la wakara misi hila la. Ima kwa febu wa wakara misi. Isi waka munu ahuera. Ereke bidon. That is the law they endorse. They decide which offender to be arrested and investigated. Look at British government. Ibori, British government. Dora Kuchinyiri, British government. Every Biafra who get across the line, British government, that is when you know British government have caught. Because they are Biafra. Where is Marodiko looting? Where is Abacha looting? They will tell you it is an art of holiness. British government will tell you, and then they bring it to Sharia law. You know, he la la he la la. Oba karami si he la la. Ogi si keji ba ken you no kamani hinu re mungo no. You never find justice. I must tell you, no justice. They kill you at will, and show no sign of remorse. They are everywhere. They are rampage, killing their friends. They decide your king. As a child, my father told me. He said in my dialect, I've said this before. Many monarchs within the Delta region were trained in our house because first son in my place is not allowed to live with the father. They leave, they send them to homes in the community to enable them to suffer. So they go, no say, kaki no be leather, head in our body. And along the line, one of them lived in our house. If he's still alive and he's listening to me, his name is Oriakose. Oriakose. He's the monarch in one of the community within the Anyocha region of Igbo Bendel, Igbo Delta. His name is Oriakose. He stayed in our house. And I remember there was a day I want to use my papa power to subdue him. My papa called me and told me, you see this guy you are seeing, he's not a slave, he's a king. 
One of these days, you're going to go to his palace, you bow before him. But the father, according to our custom and tradition, he must know what the common man is feeling so he can rule them properly. How many terrorists and jihadists ruling you know what you are going through? Does Asari know what it means to be a Christian, even though he was brought up by a Christian known as a, 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 a what do they call this hopeless man? Are you a researcher for? Are you a researcher for? She consider how he was thrown out. But let me not go there because some people say, you know, it's religion, leave religion. If you say, don't talk about religion, then we don't need to talk about this criminal British government and lunatic government and terrorist jihadists. We really don't need to talk about any of them. Men, you're going to focus and forget about the rest of men. Most of you don't know. I went on fasting 40 days. I wanted to see heaven because that power that made Moses to cross the Red Sea, I wanted to feel it. I went on fasting 40 days and 40 nights. If I know apply wisdom to common reasoning, by now I for don't die. I begin to fast one day, two days. I stayed almost two weeks, no food, no water. Oh boy, I was praying. Apostolic church, somewhere in Yoruba land, Uriuki. I can't remember the name of that community. No, look at Jesus. No, look at me, me. I was praying fervently, I must tell you. And no chop. Because they say Jesus fast 40 days and 40 nights. Moses fast 40 days and 40 nights. Me, I won't fast 40 days and 40 nights. Maybe I can bring heaven down on earth here. But do you know what happened? After two weeks, the moment Yoruba pastor lead prayer, no, look at Jesus, look at wow. Immediately I said, no, look at wow. Half of my tongue caught come out. As I said, I can't go one corner. As I go the corner, make a chop, make a no go die before wow. And I gather food, start eating. Thank God I've not eaten the food. As I gather the food, I now balance and say, make a chop. God just sent one angel in human skin. I say, what do they do? I say, I won't chop. I never chop since two weeks. Hungry one came here, I beg. The brother said, no, 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 don't eat. Don't eat. I say, why? He said, if you swallow that apple, you are dead. I now pause because I don't want to die yet to add your mama. You will die. All of you will die. Come close to me. You will understand. I'm not joking. But I want to come in a lower time so you will understand. And I pause. I said, what is happening? He said, you see, you have stayed so many days without food. If you swallow that apple, your intestines are weak. It is going to cut them and you're going to die. I said, what do I do? He said, start taking like warm tea. Drink a camel. So your intestine can reactivate. I said, thank God, though. I noticed that my tongue will appealing. Oh boy, I for don't die, you say I won't be like Moses in the Ara. I for don't die, say I won't be like Moses. Now I can't apply wisdom to common sense. The same way we are calling upon you, apply wisdom to common sense. Our supreme leader will be in the Munich in Germany. All of you in Germany begin to book reservation. The Munich in Germany, we know that there are Biafrans on the on earth here. Go there now. I would have been dead. Now I can't apply wisdom. I can't use my tongue or count my teeth. Now I can't do and gradually, manually, you know, before I go to softwarely, analogically. But when I come back, three days, a day seven to fast, you know, even as a reverend, when I say, I give you three days, 30 days fasting, I will say, follow your biological makeup, I won't come to your word, your barrier where you die because of uh, 41 days of fasting, 50 days of fasting. Because some of you think that is what it takes you to heaven or breakthrough. Most of you have died. Mad people. They kill you at will. They show no sign of remorse. They prevent you from developing even your own land. But our people are not seeing it. So it begins to make me wonder how the life of the next generation of Biafrans will be if we do nothing about it today. Our children will be so dealt with that we may not even be in control of our life. Not to talk of the next future of the next generation of Biafra. When you fight Igbo man, understand that the reason why as you are Igbo man, you are. As a Ijo man, you are. As a Goni man, you are. The reason why they don't wipe you out is because of Igbo man. 
Tessarowiwa was yapping and jumping up and down because he thought Nigerians are sincere people. They are desperate people. They blackmail their papa. Where is uh, all these people who blackmail their friends? Because they made you believe Igbo man is your problem. But go to record. The only man who refused and said that Kensar Uwa will not be murdered. His name is SADK, SADK of Ahoda land. SADK of Ahoda land. Priscilla betrayed Kensar Uwa. He's a goni woman. What is the name of this lunatic jumping off? And most of you are calling him Betama. Magnus Abbey. Well, Magnus Abbey and Priscilla were the people who endorsed that Ogoni man should be killed in Ogoni land. But only one man. Go and look at seven people, seven community, and does the killing of Ugu, uh, Ken Saruwiwa. Only Igbo man who is denying his identity that refused. That he says the DK of Ahuda. He said, you're not going to kill this man. How did they reward him for doing the truth? When Bayasa was carved out of River State, they took the oil in this Ahuda land and gave it to Bayasa people. They leave this king inside the river state without anybody to rule. Because the people is ruling is in Bayasa. So when you hear Atiku and other people telling you they are from Cameroon, but they are in Nigeria, there was a strategic movement to keep taking place there. But they never know it's going to boil down this way. Is a DK of Ahuda was later murdered. But you don't know why they murdered him. But the Igbos, having been betrayed, bastardized, set up by their own knees and kings they were the only people that fought to make sure that king saruwa was not killed but you see divided will fall apart but united we are one i'm not telling you Igbo men are angels you have many hopeless useless lunatic you see this is blooded Igbo men and women but i tell you without the Igbo biafrans <laughs> okay monu from nanya okay monu from nanya Make I stop, make on our feet, talk on our mind. But then you must understand that what I'm trying to say in effect is that Nigerian out of desperation will stop at nothing to bamboozle and destroy me and you. They will stop at nothing. Now the Kano Buiki warrior. I'll be back in a minute. If you lie on me, red with freedom or death, it's your boy you see. Then in the pocket, I'm the kind of thought that no matter to my brother, I'm the duke. Okay, to men, them bad, you're a jiri, man, red rock. That fortune has a kuku, si kuku, ro, si me. Ndo si me na bambo. Nelum baba, raba, ha, jere, wa, ya kuku, li, pesa, kuku, ako, la, ma, tu, si, tele, kalo, da, da, me, tu, sa, lo, gora, kuku. Ako, no, cha, bu, ma, ha, du, mo, bu, tu, chi, na, nye. Ngo, si, chi, nye, na, nye, nye, chi, pa, cha, ki, wu, ya. Ngo, si, chi, pa, cha, ki, wu, ya. Ana, bambo, nelum baba, raba, ha, na, chi, wu, ya. And as a question of Chitanya Nibu, I got it to Ratonare, go my happy putty ribu. Nibu, see my who may put in a book with Chia, no, and as a Nibu, a brown book, on a black at the Jumo and Mono de Putti, who no put already made bears on the same friend of Bush, and in a break at the Mewen, I can't get more here. Nam the Kano Totano Madu to my Gorota, Nam the Nutri, who can command him by your watch, you read a bread rock. La foto na se kuku si kuku ro si mi ndo si mi na bamba nelum baba raba ha jere ba ya kuku li pesa kuku ko la ma si tele kalo da da me tu se lo ko la kuku akono cha bu ma ha tu mo ko ke chine ne ngozi chine na nyo nyo chi pa ja ki wo ya ah nyo chi pa ja ki wo ya ana bamba nelum baba raba ha na chi wo ya nyo nyo chi pa ja ki wo ya ana bamba nelum baba raba ha na chi wo ya Sympathizers were like, Oh my lord, and I'm the kind of too serious. You took away the Hebrew love and peace to the indigenous. Where are on heads? Can we choose this type of counterparts? Where are the origins and the things we need to talk about? Behold, this red light I found inside in Africa. This no be joke. If you test cause that is more like pop. Israel is the light, the roots where we tap. The reason why your fear never wanna let go is the dark that we face in case you don't know. Now I tell you, game over. Oh, you need to break it, game over. I can't get more here. 
Namdi plano tota no madu to makoro ta Namdi nuche Oke kumende mbajuru wajiri be bedrock Na foto na zibu puzi kupuru simi Ndo simi na bambo Yelu mbabara bahajere baya kukuli pesa kukwa kula makisi Tele palo dada metu selo kura kuku Hakonu tabu mahadu mopu kuchine nye Ngozi chinye ranyo nye chipaja kiwe ya Nye chipaja kiwe ya Hana bambo nilu mbabara bahana chiwe ya Soldiers went a fire back to dance in Python. They never knew that they could put you down on Python. We wouldn't get my cup to leave a deal of a ton. Had it been that red or gem, I'd say, but see them all. We would have had a Python body ball and chill them all. Only see this loop, but that me would have had some more. Trudy me from Python ass. Come, come out. Ah. Sick one on the mix. Yes, at this moment, our lines are open. Our WhatsApp line is 070. 815-45642. A WhatsApp line is 070-815-45642. For the last time, a WhatsApp line is 070-815-4564. I repeat again, I beg your pardon. A WhatsApp line is 070-815-45642. A direct line is 081 52971. Our direct line is 081 221 For the last time, our direct line is 081 5297 And our number dedicated to the female is 081-288-581. Special number for the women is 081-288-58614. 288-58614 is the special number for the female. If you are a man, don't call it. If you are a man, don't call the female line. I repeat again, it's 081-288-58614. And at this moment, our lines are open. Yes, caller on the line. Yeah. Are you there? Good morning, sir. Good morning, indeed. Who? I am one of this woman. I feel like great news, sir. You have killed many diseases in our life. That's why you don't have to what is happening. And we thank IPV. They have done a great deal in our life. And God bless you, sir. They must continue. They are very sure. I want to thank God upon our leader, Magellan Mekano, and his deputy. 400 days on this. So far, what is so hard? And he later came in as well. Today he's walking around the world. Many fake prophets say a lot of things against him. Maybe they are still talking. But we thank God who is giving him the wisdom, guiding him, guiding you also. Because we know who you are. And uh, our hope, Jaffa, and nothing can stop Jaffa for us. No matter the trouble to us. I do that. Thank you. Continue. Don't let us alone. Thank you very much. Be our friends across the globe. Congregate around IPOB. We don't want to take Britain. We don't want to conquer anybody. The condition we have found ourselves is better we are living on one banana tree to the other, behaving like monkey, am, am, than to be human. Somebody told me, uh, I told my, fam uh, my family to set up IPOB in Lagos, but they're telling me that IPOB collect too much money. What is too much money? 500 Naira. Is it 500 Naira? I'm a very poor man, but 500 Naira, Kwano, when Yoruba pastors collect millions from you in the name of sowing to God, 500 Naira. And they would say, give us defense money, give us territory money, give us territory money. Can you hear me call on WhatsApp? I can hear you, Major. Good morning, sir. Good morning. Go ahead, please. Good morning, good afternoon, good evening. All the friends all over the world, depending on your time zone. Good morning to our school leader. Our deputy leader, good morning. I thank all of you this morning. I thank you, Chico Kikabiyama. For giving, us another, for giving us another opportunity to see this beautiful day. I thank him. My name is Mazi Belus, Chimese Belus Ochuku. I'm calling from Ghana. Mazi Jojo Nibe. 
I thank you so much for the work you are doing for us. It's not an easy task. I pray that you could keep them and will keep you safe. All the plans of the zoo military, all the plans of the evil ones, it will never get to you. I thank Chuko Kikabiyama and the heads of all our principal officers. I pray that Chuko Kikabiyama will keep all of us safe anywhere we are, especially those in our land, Biafra land. I thank all our people, all the people that are supporting us in one way or the other. I thank. I encourage them to keep on because the fight we are fighting is a just fight. The topic this morning is very, very good. It is high time our people wake up from their slumber and see the danger ahead and see what is happening because the British people and their company, Nigeria, they are so desperate. They don't care if all of us are being killed in as much as the, 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 the oil in our land they continue to control it. All the great thing that is coming out of it, they want to take it. Our people have to wake up. There is killing going on every day in our land. Those that call themselves kings in our land, they are not doing anything. Unlike what our brother said yesterday, that in Abreba land, what happened in Abreba land? Where Fulanis, where, where hunters saw Fulanis in the bush? and they recovered their gun and took it to their king, and their king ordered them to take the guns back to the Fulanese. What sort of nonsense is that? Could such a thing happen? Can it happen in the outer land, in the Yoruba land? It cannot happen. We should know that we don't have anybody that is speaking for us, apart from Mazenam Dekano. All of us should join IPOB family anywhere and they don't join IPOB family because it is through only IPOB that we can be saved. I thank you so much, Mazin. I thank all the IPOB members. Anywhere we are, let us keep on keeping on. Thank you. Please, Mazin, I would want to speak. There's something I would want to ask you after this program. I don't know how send, I can get to you. Send me a text message. I will respond to you. Thank you very much, my brother. Send me a text message, I will respond to you. Are you there, caller on the line? Um, yeah. My hmm. name is Ngeneka. Ngeneka. Are you monitoring me? Are you a monitoring spirit? <laughs> I'm monitoring you very, very well. <laughs> you have to pay money after this program. Go ahead, please. Uh, I will pay. I wish I will pay. Take the money from I will pay in dollar. I will pay in the front Hey. Thank you, my dear friend. Much God bless you. Much God bless all their friends all over the world. Much God bless our leader. Much God keep strengthening our leader and keep strengthening all of you that are in the Biafra. Telling us all the histories, all everything that we ought to know. Much God give you strength and knowledge, more wisdom and protection to all their friends. I, I just want to say all these names that they gave to us and they used to enslave us more. They came to our land, like you said, Abakiliki. That Abakiliki they are calling us is not our name. My father, when I was small, he told me, that uh, they are going to Nkeleke. Nkeleke is not about to reach. If you see somebody now saying Nkeleke, they, uh, they are coming from the bush. My father told me, we are not to be defeated. That even if it remains one person, that person will keep standing. You see? Oh, they have made history by themselves and tell us that we are nothing. I saw one girl that they told is from about uh, the girl started crying. That is from a boy. I said, you are, you are stupid. This thing was happening far, far, far. Beyond that, I told, I told her, I am a Bakileke girl. And I can't deny my... My, my place 
He said, no, uh, she was crying. I called her a Jewish girl. They are crying because somebody was using an abusive word calling her back to me. So we are not to be defeated. We are strong people. We are, to be, we are strong people. If you go to war, even if it's one person, that person will keep on fighting until you get what you want. And that is who you are. I don't know why people accept the history of a white man that doesn't that wasn't born here, that don't know what we are. But I don't know. I don't know. Uh, I thank our leader. And I thank you, Kiko Gamma, mostly for lifting him up and sustain him. Because if he's in our power, we can't sustain him. But he sustains him and keep on helping him. His family did not reject him. His father kept following him and left his throne for his son. Oh. Which could have been a blessed old man and keep strengthening him and his wife. They will live and see Jasra. Nothing will happen to them. They will live and see Jasra. Yeah, I can't remember. I don't know. In Nigeria, I know what the, the deep things they have done. This name, I call Nigeria, in the next, should I say, two to three years to come, if you hear Nigeria, the person will run, run inside a, a forest and think that we are yet evil, evil name. Because these people have done so much evil, so much evil have packed. I have told my pastor, if you are praying for Nigeria, us, I will kill you. They say that uh, I'm cursing somebody. I'm not uh, uh, normal. After all, I'm speaking like our leader, Mazen Ambekan, is always cursing somebody. I said yes because you don't understand. Because you don't know. And how would you communicate it? Stop praying for these people. You are, you are cursing yourself. By praying and fasting for Nigeria to be better, you are cursing your, your whole being. You are cursing yourself. But I want to thank school cousin. They are all listening to radio. They are telling the news as I did. They are listening. They are changing. They are, they are not, they, they understand themselves now. They understand where they are. Yoruba, that made, that made uh, this man called Samsung. I'm no longer hearing him now. I always like to buy his album because of the way he sings a uh, Christian song. But today, after he gathered his people, the people that are singing Buchi, all of them, uh, Frank Edward, they all contributed money and buy Chris Economy, yes. Yoruba Man, yes. a private jet. Uh, the guy Gineka. couldn't make a new album again. Gineka. Gineka. What is all this? Gineka. You just confused Sir. this money. Are you from Abakiliki? Yes. Are you kidding me? No, it's not it's not Let me ask you, is he, are, are you from, are you from uh, Aba? Let's get it, that pronunciation, where Aba Nkeneke. Yes, Nkeneke. Aba Nkeneke. Aba Nkeneke. Or you are from yes. Aba Nkeduna. Aba Nkeneke. Nkeneke, the other one is the British name. Don't worry, we will just post and hope completely when the time comes. Thank you very much, my sister. We must continue. Yeah, we God my blessing, my Lord God. I'm blessing. We will God my blessing, our leader. And as it should be for the man that stands to when no other man stands. We will God my blessing. Thank you, thank you. We must continue. Let God be a son. Okay. I see, I see. Yes, can, can you hear me call on the line? Yes, I can hear you, my daddy. My daddy, you have a good morning. Don't call me daddy. You want me to be ah. very old? <laughs> call I will call my, it. my young you. You call me daddy, <laughs> I become old. I that tell I my church member not to call me daddy before I come pass my father. 
is here. Is here where you talk like this, uh, what about our daddy will be pastor of our land? <laughs> If we see our papa, our father say we don't owe say we call our own because we don't give daddy. So I need to call you daddy because you're a strong man of God. Good morning, Good morning again, my brother. Good morning, Biafra. My name is Ekenna. I normally call you. I come from Akwa Ibom. I come from the government. So uh, that is why I call you, my daddy, because number one, you normally give me every day every five o'clock and even nine o'clock in the evening. You normally give me joy. And you normally make me to understand where, where I be. And you normally make me to understand where I belong to. And you normally make me to understand who be my brother, who not be my brother. As uh, your, you talk about uh, this man, uh, Asali. This Asali, Asali, one Asali, two Asali, three. Asali, Asali, Jibin. I want to let you know that all if you go to go China, Ujago, this man down is our our people. You know all the Ujago people. You know if you see young youth again from Ujago, all of them are our people. You go to the Niba, the same thing. They come to Slata, our man and Indigen. So, our the just this uh, topic that always make me to wake up and make me to know the kind of woman the how the kind of woman the kind of blood that we get. How, why they don't want to follow your topic so that we wake up in time. I'll be right now, I cover where we don't know, know the break, now we wake up. So you normally make, you normally wake my spirit and you normally make me to know that you are a man of God. And I know that typical girl, I always give the topic every day by day and the topic is true. It's no one be lying. I say continue for your good work. Be after listening for the voice and let us make ourselves well so that we can meet up. Look at the way we suffer. Even though I, I, I asked one of my brothers yesterday, when you suffer like this, the money with the husband now, we know she am way better. What tell our children will come to be now? What tell our children will come and ask their self question? So go ask yourself question the same this thing, and you bring the topic this money to you. So God will bless you. And let God still give you anger. No man for your family, no woman for our, for our community. Thank you very much. You work for you work for angel, and the angel of God will guide you. Thank you. In the name of Jesus, Christ. You see, you see. We must God bless you. Thank you. Caller, what's up? Are you there? I'm there. Good, Good morning, sir. Good morning. Go ahead, please. Uh, watch Nike. Jojo Ibe. Good morning. I greet you. My name is uh, Sunday Abu. I'm calling from Enugu State in Biafra land. My brother, I greet all of Biafra worldwide. I greet you now, Ricardo. And I greet you, General Son. The other you are greet. Thank you so much. And I thank you for the good work. A few days this morning, I want to speak in my diet. I'm from any, I mean, a native of any state. From Nkano, Okunano, Obago. Oh, uh, here is this morning. About Yemen and River State in Libya on Wednesday. Hello? Go ahead, please. Hello? Go ahead. Hello? Yes. So, yeah, yeah. I'm on that place now, Ron. So we the fight to be done. Lena, Jinjo, one of my worker, who is a Bible, said, Hey, yeah, that we have this fight. But since that now, now one of our brother from our Bible, Boya Osa, now on Tuesday, around 1 a.m., for a drop, Ghana, Osa, Ebana, Baba Osa, in Ebe. That drop on the person. The moment I drop on the man, Eba, now so we could to that man. Could to a Kujo Yoko. We hear what the known. I bring a bring machine this man. So the man no no we we be a cause of the year made our boys to do making well direct well because of our Wednesday. Of course, most be made that he did. Now what's that? 
ama esmo pote na kwa demu mada kwa ndi kwa ndi kani yura mandi na ita dreta sina kapa na ita kani yura au sasa sana ndege everywhere like my brother yesterday in the bar when you are crying yesterday I was crying because I live my life in Lagos I grew up in Lagos sometimes when he talk about you boss he said the truth I live for Lagos. How my shop was born in 2007 in Tojosho, December 12th. It was Lagos State Government that brought that money in Lagos. If you made a letter of the Tojosho, December 12th, when the shop let was, me when tell, the market let was me tell you something. Can you hear me? Can you hear me? Let me tell you something. Eh? You. As yes, a I child, know. every December, the Igbo Biafra shop must be burnt across the Nigerian zoo. Ochanja market burnt. This market burnt. This one burnt. And you know what they tell us at home? They told us that the Igbos are ritualists. That the Igbo Biafrans, they use the burning of shop to renew their ritual charm. This is what I was told as a child. So every December, he said, yeah, Igbo shop born for Ali Balogu. Igbo shop born for Idumota. Igbo shop born for uh, Abula Ebo Weli Yuton. Igbo shop born for Onecha. Igbo shop born for Kaduna. Igbo shop born where? We could say, oh, then they renew their charm. So we really don't have pity for them. But now I know that Yoruba won't sign Nigerian government are the one doing that, taking the reducing us drastically, financially, economically, and otherwise. They think they are emasculating us. Since IPOB came, since Nan the Kano came, why is Ibo shop not burning? Our drone is waiting for them. Our, what do you call it? Our satellites are beamed on them. Let's see the ritual is burning Ibo shop. You see, the few areas where Igbo shop have burned, Igbo Biafran shop have burned. You have that of uh, Nasarawa. You have that of, uh, is it Kano? But you will see, there are evidence that I was suffering and he burnt it down. Yoruba would have told you that it's Igbo ritualist. Today night, it's Yoruba people stealing female pants. It is Yoruba cutting head now and doing all nonsense. It's no longer Igbo. <laughs> If you are not, you hold, you hold up, sorry for interrupting you. If you are not paying for Radio Biafra, if you are not an IPOB member supporting this project, you are the hopeless buffoon as a black chimpanzee that you are. Come back, forget your, your tie. Come out, your gentleman. If you are not waiting, these people prepare for us. Without Mazen and the can we came on here, we are gone as a people. So when you're telling me you're bringing Python dance to my land, understand that there is a Python that owns the bush. He's Mazen and the can he came on here. Please go ahead. Yeah. Yeah, my brother. Because as a, as a child, I live, I live, I left my state when I was a child in 1906. I lived with my uncle in, in in Lagos, a street called Awaneke Street, near to Surulere, near to uh, 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 the uh, That's where we live. What ever that is going on there as a child, that's where I grew up there. I left Lagos in 2007 after the fire accident. Then, if you if go for Tojo Chanyaba, then they know my uncle, who is my master staff, is a well rich, rich man, a wealthy man. My brother, it is what, what caused this, that fight. That, that, the Eurobars got angry that the shop, the market was built in a way that the Yoruba women, they give the Yoruba women the shop. And now the Igbo people begin to buy all the shop. When they bought all the, they find out that the, all the whole shop in Tojo Shah and Yaba was bought by Igbo people. The first, the first fire they set was in Yaba in 2002. That's when they set the fire. And the fire burned the, the stolen clothes. I am just telling our people to wake up. I, am, I live in Lipa State. That's where I live. Because of that, I have to go back. I have to say, let me go back to my Biafra land. I'm sorry. I never, before, before in 2005, I never knew anything about Biafra. It was my friend, my friend from Benin, his grandfather, which is the Osa. They call it Osa. That is the most, uh, my friend, Osa. His grandfather was the 
one who told me that I am a Biafra. I live in Fadi, then. I never know. My father never told me that I'm a Biafra. My mother never told me that. It was this man who from Benin that told me, me and my friends, we are for that. We are, we are friends to his grandchildren. We are some people from uh, Ababo, some people from Imo and uh, Adia. We all of us, we are friends with his children, with his grandchildren. So one day we came to the, the day that when the Mosop was uh, Mosop was parading at the uh, the Mosop day. So Yaba was shut down. They closed the Yaba market and all the other market in Lagos was closed. That they would not go to market. So those those children came to uh, our house and we decided to go to their place. So when my other okay, you people not go to market. And we say yes. He said, do you know that this thing that this is you believe in Biafra? I say what? He began to tell us the story. He gave us the real story. He told us that Igbo man, that Igbo, that Igbo, Igbo tribe religion was the best tribe religion in Africa before the white men came. That is when when I heard Nandika in 2015 and I began to follow Nandika. I told my neighbor in Portugal that what Nandika is said that I have heard this from an elder man who died for age of water to, to six years. That man is from Benin. In, in Fadi, in a that is the way the man lived, the man built the house there. I am not just telling me, but I'm just using this opportunity to take our Biafras all over the world. And those who is not hearing, please, they should wake up in their slumber. Wake up. Wake up. Those people have surrendered us. If, if, if you go to Uribe, go to Uribe, live and take the house, surrender that, that area. Go to, that is every, that Uribe, they have surrendered to you. So they have surrendered the area that is a place. Hello? Hello? Yes, sir, my Hello? brother, try and summarize. Yeah. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. So oh, I, I want to use this opportunity, you know, to thank God Almighty, the Chuko Kadiama, the creator in heaven, who made it possible for us to have a, a Messiah in our own time. Because if it's not the man in the car, by now, by now, by now, my brother, all of us have to be killed. Everything that you are saying is the truth. Because I have my family living in the north. My elder sister, my senior brother, my junior, they live in the north. I have, I have been north, but I did not stay long in the north. I know what is going on there. I pay them visit. I know what they are, they, they are, the pains they are facing. Many of Thank them, you. they are even yesterday. Thank you. Yeah. So I just, I don't want to use this opportunity to greet the thing. Thank you very much for the good work you are doing. Continue. All my Tichuko Kabiyama is in your people's side. God bless you people. In Tichuko Kabiyama, we pray. You see. You see? Our people <laughs> must understand the level of desperation that drives the zoo called Nigeria. And that you should rest desperately. For depth, call it unto depth. Are you there, call on WhatsApp? Yes, I'm here, sir. Ife. I'm here, sir. Good morning, sir. Good morning, Ife. Are yes. you trying to cause hold up yes. in my line? No, 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 no. I don't try to <laughs> pass it. Go ahead, Thank please. you very much. Gogo, uh, go bless you, sir. Gogo, bless you. I get very, very proud of you, sir. Gogo, uh, go bless you for the wonderful job you do for us. Because it's not for now. We don't know where we for they for all the work like blind people, all they do like they live like zombies. We don't know where our left, we don't know our right. But thank God, saying of our time, thank God, come bring people like Una. Our 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 leader, Mazuna the Kanu, our able deputy leader, IPOB worldwide for the great and wonderful, perfect job when they do. God will bless all of them, all of us. Mazi, uh, for the contribution, our people for the upper river. Lowdown River, eh, Ninja Delta, Jecha Ninja, all of them. They don't know waiting, wait till they come after them. Most of us just they live eh, for Belay, for Mount, pay our strength, do one or two things, both children, both children for different, different place, live them younger, younger life. They don't know waiting to post our people what they live as, as a race, as a people. Instead of them now, so are they appreciate what our Igbo Biafran they do for this war front where they day they fight on daily basis? 
we the food come on fine we we come ah these people we we appreciate them no with our people some of our the big god the way they say we don't know they are left from their right they're going to raise their man like christmas dog if no for radio be a fan now nah, now we the push dog now we be prostitute now we be criminal now we be kidnapper now we be price stealer now we they go abroad now we they, if it not be radio biafra we they call the the analyze my, my sister my sister are they online they wait yoruba guta media to call to dent mm. the image of one biafran person are they wait for them they are now they are saying the truth yes. before kidnapper baby factory murder for one night every evil oh are, all this drug oh killer the drug dealers now nigerian drug dealer across the globe therefore tell you saying a biafra or their name for change to ibo yes. men them bring them on with the wait for them when we are done with when Nigeria, they, they wish they never existed. Yoruba and our Wosafu Lani, they will you. regret what they've done to us. Over 200 years, I'm they've been working you, on the Mendola and Blancata of our people. They will never go away from it. They will never. They can we never pity go those free. Biafrans who are as the association and assimilation. This is not French land. This is not English land. This is the land of Biafra for the avoidance of doubt. Yes. Manzi, you say, if it be said that people will not conquer, May they may have may all of us perish, but it's we in perish. our sea, our own land. Now we 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 won't restore our own land, our own dignity, our own rights. Say me go, me to go to Kiabi. I'm not going to listen. Me continue to frustrating us. Me continue to empower us. So let us say uh, we restore this very this very uh, right of 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 our, our of our own. We say we, we we don't lost for for many years ago. Me, to restore this thing. No matter anything they talk, God go bless the day we we give our supreme leader Mazuma the come. This says may they restore this, may they restore this a radio biasa for us. Now, now we are in charge, man. We are in charge because we don't want to listen to anything they talk again. As far as they get their source of listening to radio, their news, we we get source of listening to our news. We don't listen to their news. If they learn, they don't listen to our news. We will propagate this very gospel. Man, this only, I don't say this morning, we will quickly they, uh, finish. Yesterday, I got opportunity to talk to somebody. He called the service, eh, eh, this only, only don't do. Eh, man, this only, can't do that. Say they don't do. This only, that's another thing. Don't tell me that place, they raise your mind like Christmas. Though. If they're in America, they raise your mind like Christmas. Though. If it be said to them, man, say, they can say, okay, everybody, fire on. Then, if a man, if a be after now, they run, they go now, but man, come see, and I go, they say, who they tell me now? You say, I'm not going to stop this thing, what they do? You feel that the, 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 the gospel, who don't preach, you don't reach for us to go, they fight to work. As in my brother, let me say, they fight to work. If you say, you're not you'll be not telling me, make a note, make a tap, you'll be saying, make a note, make a note, make a note. What do you, what do for that thing? You, you beat past that, you don't do a you don't be part of person to jump. I make I tell you all of them are You not be say this is not the kill us or the kill all of them. You say you are an Igboma or you are an Oboma. I say they go spare you. All of them will be IPOB and they will kill all of us. All of them are Better for you. Yes, it better go join IPOB. Better for you. The 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 gospel who will not propagate. It will it never sink rich because we need to impregnate our people with it with the truth. With the truth before we go engage on, on anything. Because now they the division, now they now they will fix this office. But in unity, they can never succeed. Don't wait till they have to know what happen again. We they continue to talk. We never tire to talk. We they continue to talk. We go continue to talk. So tell, so tell before our people. They, go, yeah. they have forgotten. Much, they man. have forgotten that God created the world by His word, eh? and yes. He destroyed the world by His word, and He sustained yes. the world by His word. Nigerians, we yeah. understand. My people, we say, O Talo Kanshi, O Talo Kanshi. And you can buy water, they don't know what is going to happen to them. They, they, yeah. are, they are more afraid than the Radio Biafra than AK 47. Thank you yes. very much, Ife. That's true, sir. They will know the truth. That's very true, sir. God bless Thank you. Thank you very much. Yes. God, God bless you, sir. Thank you. This is where we draw the curtain for this morning's segment. Moment of inspirational grit, I must tell you. We are going home. We are not here to conquer anybody. Eh? Yoruba, take your good, good, take your guru, take your nama. I will say, take your timber and koku. Go, leave us, let us be. Because this relationship you are looking for, very soon we will tell you that we are one Nigeria. You will run for one Nigeria. Those people bringing Islam to jihadists, very soon you will see, we will turn to jihadist Muslim. You will surprise. We are not against any religion. 
if you are a Biafra man going to Yoruba church, you are hopeless, you will go to hellfire, and I'm the gate man of hellfire. Thunder will fire you. Because I wonder why Yoruba who is taking you to heaven. Don't go to church, Pastor by Akwa Ibon or Ibu or a John man. And you are there going there, you are yapping in winners and all this Yoruba church. Colonizing master, indirect colonization and colonialism. No, 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 you gotta don't say that. They gotta don't say that. If you're gonna say that, you're gonna you're gonna, gonna provoke Christians, you're gonna provo provoke Muslims, you're gonna provoke or God more. I'm gonna provoke all of you because all of you don't have sense. All of you don't have sense because you're gonna know that man was gonna born for religion, religion was not gonna born for man. I sign up for here, make a come out for here, may God be with all of us. Make I don't forget I be Biafran, I know they apologize. I know they apologize, those of you in Germany, West Germany, North Germany, East Germany, South, South Germany, Central Germany, the Munich, everywhere you do. Our leader, Mazen, now they can't know they come for the Munich. Intention not to come address on and make on and see waiting they all go on. Because the chuku chuku way they for eye bob. Now, wisdom they use the come out and more you blind the eye. If you get question, come there, come answer. I mean, go there to answer you. Then they call them all rally, formatically, go answer on. No day for corner day, yeah, because this rain where they got, I go beat every one of us. But one thing you go know, be say, if you lie, fool yourself. Become one Nigeria or one Nigeria, you know, consign me. If you lie, become anything where you want to become. But the truth be say, we be Biafra and we know they hide ourselves. May God begin to be with all of us now. He say, he say, he say. <laughs>